All right. Hello, my name is Tanner Sisla. Uh, this is my final project. Uh, I've titled it Teleport with a Weather Report. Um, and so basically I wanted to create uh, a simplified version of an AR system, an augmented reality system. Uh, so I'm really passionate about uh, inclusive uh, inclusive design and accessibility and the idea of using technology as a tool to help folks with disabilities kind of achieve um, their personal kind of goals and uh, explorative ideas for how they want to approach nature. Um, and so by using kind of the system uh, or at least a kind of a more advanced system that I had theorized uh, a little while ago, um, the idea here is to be able to step outside or roll outside or just occupy space outside um, in a very comfortable way, a very easy way. Um, and then being able to, or al allowing the augmented reality system to process the weather data that kind of exists in real time around you. And then being able to pinpoint geolocate different locations all over the world um, that match that data. So you're having the kind of physical experience of feeling the external stimuli around you um, in the form of kind of temperature, humidity, wind, time of day, et cetera, et cetera. Um, and then being able to connect that with a visual and auditory um, stimuli kind of in front of your face. So you're experiencing different visuals while feeling um, the world that's actually happening around you. Um, so uh, I created a very simple interface to kind of represent that idea. Um, like I said, I've got temperature, humidity, wind, and time of day. Um, so I've set seven different scenes um, that you can kind of pinpoint. So it's only going to play the audio slash visual um, if those parameters are met relative to the, the environment that is being shown. Um, so I'll just do a few for you. Uh, let's see if we go down to here, about here, about here, and about there, we've got um, a chairlift. Um, Kind of a nice serene chairlift and you're kind of riding along um and so again you would only be able to feel this hypothetically if these temperature humidity wind and time of day parameters are met um, in real time so if we go to let's see about here and then i have the kind of data on my phone to just uh, expedite this process but uh, here, about there, there. Um, it's a cute deer eating some leaves, and it's really just nice to look at and quite serene. Um, so I'll show you one more. Um, if we go to about here, and then we go to point six. So this is static data, obviously. Um, I would have preferred to use a weather API and live data, um, but it just got too complicated. So we kind of settled for this. Um, let's see, 13, 8, 26, and then temp is 80. Thirteen, eight, and Uh, <laughs> being so uh, but yeah, so now we're in Venice, Italy. Um, just a nice scene. 